Hey, good morning everybody. It's Tuesday, April 14th. Good morning. It, uh, it's going to be um, kind of sunny in the morning today and uh, then there's going to be a little cloud mix this afternoon. High of 45 degrees. So chillier than yesterday, but nonetheless, there's no rain. So you can always get out there and enjoy a nice walk or bike ride. I know I've been on some Zooms with some kids that told me that they've been going for some hikes. Um, so any trails that are open, get on out there. Got a woods in your backyard, get on out there, play, have some fun. Um, so uh, we have, the first thing we have today is reading. We have some countries comparisons today. So. Um, hopefully you've wrapped up all of your country's research and you've done all that you needed to do to find things that um, I mentioned to you in my video yesterday, finding things on the countries, um, their education, the, the festivals they have, um, their government, the kings and queens, what do, what do students do in um, those countries, like how long do they go to school, what's a school look like. Um, other things like the language they speak, the location, a lot of you focused in on animals of those countries, which are great because you guys love to do animal research. But today we're going to compare those two. So maybe start today by opening up your reader's notebook and drawing a T-chart and kind of comparing the two. Um, where they are at um, on the globe. Are they on different sides of the globe? Do they speak different languages? Do they speak the same languages? Um, do they celebrate the same holidays? Do they have um, the same religions? Um, so those are some things to think about and how they're different as well. Um, what kind of people that live there? Do they look different? Do they sound different? Do they dress differently? So those are things that you can think about today when you do your comparison. And then I have one little doc in your uh, language arts Google Classroom today to turn in. And they're just some sentences to fill in about comparing those two countries. So you can say um, China has a, a, a different uh, government than um, Brazil. Um, and then you can go on to talk about that. So those are all in there. Uh, that, that doc is in there for you to turn in today. Um, so give that a try. We have library today. So go to your um, library Google Classroom and check out the, uh, anything that Mrs. Lyons had given you today. And then we have math. Uh, math is pretty simple today. We're just working on um, expanding our thinking with arrays and uh, it's a simple two problem turn in, so not so much on the math side and a little bit more on the language arts side today. Um, Writer's Workshop is polishing up our, our rough drafts and I will, um, I will give you a final draft soon uh, section in your Google Classroom so that you can turn in a final copy of your story. and. Uh, like I said before, if you want to share with me a video of you reading your uh, fairy tale, um, you can do that via Dojo. You can email it to me. Um, you can uh, just record it on your Chromebook and then share the video with me. That's fine. Um, but practicing that, vid that story over and over again, practicing in front of an audience, uh, making a puppet show, uh, <laughs> making a stop motion video, anything like that it's going to get the more you read the story the more you edit it the more you proofread it the more you look at it and say and revise it and go wow my story's come along so that's the whole point um and then we'll be getting our second fairy tale here very soon and then we have zoom meetings today i think most of the zoom meetings they have today are language arts related so if you do have a zoom meeting today please check your email check your calendars um, your Zoom meetings are in your Google Calendar, and I've emailed each and every one of you, invited you into the Zoom meeting. If you don't feel like you got a Zoom meeting and you were supposed to get one, please let me know. Um, the password and the link are all in the calendar, and they are all in the uh, in your email as well. So please check those. I have a few of those meetings today and come with your country's research and we can work on um, writing some of those comparison sentences 
and talk about uh, the comparing of your two countries. So hopefully you guys have a wonderful Tuesday. Uh, stay busy, stay curious, build stuff, send me pictures of what you're doing. I miss you guys a lot and I hope all is well. Oh yeah, and um, sending out the hashtag today, yesterday was the um, fitness. Today is uh, wear your, uh, I guess you could call it flowery shirts, uh, Hawaiian shirt. I don't own any of those, so I just stuck with a hoodie today. So <laughs> hopefully all is well. I miss you guys again, and have a great morning.